In this segment, we're going to show you a brand new product we have. It's a temporary paint that you can spray on the side of a vehicle uh, for something like maybe a high school football game, maybe state U. Um, we're actually going to do on the side of this, we're going to do a little stencil here, and maybe towards the back of the vehicle, we'll maybe do some uh, lettering. The great thing about this product is uh, it's not going to come off in the rain. Um, it's not going to, you can scrape it, if you scrape real hard on it, but uh, you're not going to rub off and just come up against it, and it's going to stay on there. And once we do wash it off, it's going to leave no residue whatsoever. I want to recommend against not using it on the windows as uh, it might not only be illegal in your community but it's going to block out your view as well and might cause an accident. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and stencil this out here and we're going to get going on this and uh, we'll see how it looks. As you can see we got the stenciling almost done here on the, on the side of the minivan. I'm going to go ahead and put this uh, S on here and then we're going to go ahead and start spraying it. Okay, we're going to go ahead and put a nice coat of this on. Great thing about this product is if you get a little bit of runs or a little mistake, it's going to cover up no problem. It dries in about 30 seconds. You can see it's spraying on the side of the van here, but you can use this multiple places. You can use it in the front window to say Happy Halloween or Merry Christmas. Or you can use it... Uh, in a storefront that shows something's on sale. You can even use it out here on the on the uh, concrete to uh, maybe draw some lines for a kid's basketball hoop. And the great thing about this is you want to take it off, soap and water, a little sponge, it's going to come right off, leave no residue whatsoever. Now that we get this all sprayed out, nice couple uh, deep coats here, I'm going to go ahead and pull this off and we're going to show you how it looks. As you can see, we got it all done. I noticed I got a little overspray in the window here. We want to make sure we get everything off any kind of window, any kind of tail light or headlight cover. So what you want to do is just take a nice wet rag like this. And it'll come right off, no problem. Get it wet like that. You can wipe it right off. Easy as that. On this uh, back panel here, we're just going to do a little freehand here. I got a different color and I'm going to spray Go Team on here. Now what we're going to do is I'm going to show you how to get the, uh, the paint off the side here. It comes off real easy. What I do want to show you is I can get a hose here, and you can see I got that beading on there pretty good. Didn't even touch it. So when you're out there with rain, it's not going to touch it. Snow, it's not going to touch it unless you get that, and then you get a little agitation with a sponge or a rag. Then it'll come off real nice and easy. And you're going to have no residue whatsoever. Just like that. If you happen to get it on a window, like I said, just wipe it off. If you happen to get it on your clothes, it'll come off, no problem. Water soluble. Make sure you get that wet. Rubs right off. You can also use a power washer as well if you would like. In this case, for people who don't have a power washer, I'm just going to demonstrate with a, with a hose here and a simple sponge. You can see like that, no residue whatsoever.